Okay, another episode finished. Well, I guess I should get to thinking about what I'm going to do next. Either Super Mario Sunshine for the GameCube or Sonic Adventure for Dreamcast, since I have one of those. But the question is, which one? Okay, which one? I seriously need to decide. This uh, project is getting closer to closer to closing. Uh, I'll put it off for a bit. Let's play some PS2. Um, hello? Um, so it's plugged in, right? Yeah, it's plugged in. Um, okay. PS2 is not working. Which means I've lost probably a whole bunch of progress. And the only way to get it back is to play it back up again. On PS3. Hmm. I think the shortest one was Mega Man 8, so I could probably play that for the channel. I think that'd be fun. No, nope, never mind. I'm just gonna play Spelunky, a randomly generated uh, platformer, which is a series of randomly generated rooms that you have to get past. And yeah, since it's a it's a platformer, that's actually my bread and butter. This is right up my alley. Problem is, I can't beat it. I guess I'm kind of using this as an excuse to finally get to one of the games in my library. Because, like, I, I'm currently playing the PC version. I also have this on Switch, and I cannot beat it there either. So, yeah. We have a couple characters here to choose from. But we're going to stick with the standard guy. And, um... While I do want to get the true ending, I feel like I'll be satisfied if I get the regular one as well. And this will, I think this will be a much different, um, record it. Like, this will be different from, like, Pokemon Red Vanilla, where, like, that was, like, RPG. I'm like, RPGs are slow. Right. But this, this is quick. This is a quick paced thing. Maybe. Because I tend to be very calm, oh my gosh, that I tend to be very cautious. Which won't stop me from failing, but. Oh, oh boy. Ugh! Ah, go down. There we go. Okay. So let's throw that up there. Yes! I think the furthest I've made it is 4 4. And that was on the Switch version. Yeah, have not beat this game, and I, I want another reason to beat this game, beat one of the games in my library, in my Steam library specifically. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll, I can explain all the mechanics of the game as we go along. So you can run, jump, but uh, you have a whip, like Indiana Jones, you can crouch, grab things, and with certain things you can also uh, use them as weapons. Uh, if you press the right button, you can activate bombs, which blow up a certain amount of distance. Um, this is one of the people that you can save. However, um, because if you save them, they will give you a heart. Nice. They will give you a heart when you if you bring them to the end of the stage. Which is great. Because I'm prone to messing up all the time. However, um, if you fall on spikes, those hearts don't matter because that's a, just a one hit KO. Uh, something I like to do is, like, whenever I have the girl, I will, um. I will find area. If I want to explore a certain area, I'll place her down in this area where she can't really move. And uh, just completely avoid the implications that she that I essentially beat her down to get her to stop moving. <laughs> yes, so I can take her to the door, but I can still move around. But yeah, I think that's about all the explaining stuff. And with that, let's see on a one one. 
Okay, I can explain that. Terrible chill runs up your spine. Well, this is the result screen. Um, a terrible chill runs up your spine means there is a ghost in the level. And uh, that ghost will follow you no matter where you go. And uh, if you let that ghost catch you, then uh, you're done. That is also an insta-kill. Which is really bad. So yeah, I you want to avoid those as much as you can. So yeah, now I believe that's everything to explain. Oh well, I mean there is something else, but I'll explain it as I go along. Let's see. Go! Oh, no, that was the wrong way. Key. So this is one of the things you need to unlock the true ending. Actually, another thing I can explain, uh, if you hit the top button, you can activate a rope. So yeah. So this will be a whole lot of me reacting. Now you can actually attack the girl, which can be detrimental if you're trying to get more health. That's a giant spider. I don't like these. They take eight hits to kill and bounce all over the place. So what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try and throw a bomb. Get it in the spider webs. I missed. Oh crap. Crap. One, two. Okay. Stop. 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 No. Stop. Get out of there. Get out. Get out of there. Oh gosh. I don't like this. Oh no. Stop. Get away from me. Stop. Uh, go down. Uh, no! Oh my. Uh. You're gonna see a lot of that. So, yeah, this is essentially going to be repeating the same room. Well, not the same rooms. The same area. Similar settings until I finally win. So, uh, yeah. These can go on for a while. I don't think it'll go nearly as long as an episode as Pokemon Red Vanilla. I'm so happy I can say that now. <laughs> like, wow, it's in the past! Which isn't to say I think that series was a complete disaster aside from episode 13. But like, it was definitely uh, longer and I think I got tired. I don't think I got tired of it because it was definitely fun beating Pokemon Red for the first time. <laughs> no, this is something I actually haven't beat before. Cause like, yeah, I haven't beat, I didn't beat Pokemon Red, but I did beat um, Pokemon Blue versions and uh, Special Pikachu editions, which are very similar. Okay, I have to drop down. Okay. So yeah, this is a completely different game. And actually, I was inspired by a content creator that you all may have known, called uh, Alpharad. I saw his uh, Splunky too. I said, hey, what's the first one like? Because that looks really fun. Yeah, it's this, and it's hard. <laughs> really hard. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, that was me being dumb. Okay. Go. There we go. Where is the goal? Yes. To do that. Nope. Okay, now you're in. I don't have to worry about you anymore. What's in you? Okay. Pass the first room again. Snakes. Okay, so this is a shopkeeper. I'll let you buy certain things. I know speedrunners use the teleporter, but I personally like the jetpack more, just because I like that um, ability to, I guess, stabilize the jump. You know what? Let's try the teleporter. So I believe, how does this work? How does this work? Well, if you don't ever, if you ever want to know what an item does, 
Hit pause. Never mind. Hit select. Go to your items. You can flip through all these and discover what they do. So in this case, a piece of futuristic technology, but it hasn't been perfected yet. Never mind, I thought this was going to tell me how to use it. Um, okay, how do I use this? Yeah, speedrunners use that all the time in speedruns. Or from this one speedrun I've seen. So I have no idea how it works. Apparently it's spammable, but I don't... Yeah, no. I, I don't know. <laughs> so yeah, I essentially wasted my money. and That's pretty... Oh! Those are useful. How do I use this? No? How do I use this? I actually don't know. Right, this was a waste of my money. Awesome. How do I use this? I actually want to know. Maybe if I hold... No? Holding the button isn't doing it. Rapidly pressing the button isn't doing it. I think. How do I use this thing? What? It is why! Oh, I was letting go of it before. Okay. Okay. Um, I need to get you. Oh, that's easy. Uh, let's do that. Get away. So this can serve as like an emergency thing. Oh gosh. Um, I have to drop that. Yeah, music slows down, get that, and I collect anything else. And there it is! I don't like to see that thing. <laughs> okay, now that I know how to use this thing, let's roll. Uh, so yeah, I can just do that. <laughs> okay, parachute, and more rope. Awesome. Okay. So that I can also use this to just... Okay, dangerous, interesting. Okay, it doesn't look like I can teleport down. I can only teleport left, right, and up. Okay, you'll learn something- oh my gosh! No, I'm trying to get over there. Uh, go! Okay. Ha! Ah! Can't fool me! I fool you. I also, I also like, really like getting the climbing glove. Ah! Don't let me know you're there. Uh. Let's do. I have an idea. I stick you over here. Bye. There. And. I feel like that's how most people kill spiders. Uh, so up I. Yeah! Didn't help at all. Oh gosh. You could take one hit. Oh, or I guess it already went. Ah. Bye. Apparently the lady isn't affected by enemies. Didn't know that. Uh, okay. I have to dodge you somehow. First of all, I should probably take care of the snake. Okay. Let's try. That is so nerve-wracking. <laughs> Okay, how do I get the key? Okay. Yeah, I'm now in this room. 